What's up, guys? Um, this is just a quick tutorial. Well, I don't know how quick, actually. Um, just a tutorial on the beat effect or the um, flash effect for Sony Vegas, and this is gonna be for 11. Um, I know there's a, there's just a lot of tutorials for like uh, ones on 10, but I haven't seen one on 11, so I just wanted to do a uh, tutorial for 11 because. Um, basically the one uh, for 10, it doesn't really work on 11, unless there, well, unless there's a way that I'm not figuring out, but the, um, the fume pipe tutorial doesn't work on 11, just because I don't even know why, but it just doesn't. So just come here, and you're going to want to open up a clip, uh, I have no idea what I want to open up here. Um, let's do this one. This is actually my clip. I was playing on Mufasa's account because I was at his house, but this is really my clip. Just figure out where you want to start. Um, just where you want to start the clip. Start right here. And you're going to want to add a video track to this. Well, first, actually, you have to find a uh, song you want to put. I'm going to do Heartbreaker by Her Bright Skies. Because it's got a drum beat in it. And I just did it with a song, so. Fine, you gotta Direct from the start. Take this right here. Well, first, of course, you have to disable, resample, and everything on the clip. So, right around here is the drum beat, which is where you're going to want to put the, um, the flash on, or I just where I'm going to put the flash on. Put markers where it the drum begins and where it ends, and uh, you want it to end like a couple frames after, a uh, couple frames after the um, drum ends. Wow, well, sorry. Or wherever the beat drops, this is happens to be just right before the beat drops. So I'm just gonna drag this right here. Extend this out. Um, put this on quarter just because my computer has decided it doesn't want to be a good computer. And draft quarter is lagging, which is never a good sign. Um, but anyway, you can hear right there that. Um, that the beat is dropping. I'm sorry for such a bad tutorial. This is like my first one, and I know I'm like being really slow, but I'm not really completely focused. Anyway, what you're gonna do is first of all, here I'll show you why the old tutorial does not work in 11, and why it works in 10. Um, basically. If you do, I'm just gonna do a quick one here, a couple, just a couple cuts, and I'll redo this after. But if you, in the old tutorial, in Fume Genesis's tutorial, basically all you had to do was come up here, select brighter, drag this in. That's when you just had to animate it to the end, or wherever you wanted it to end, and make that zero. So for that one, it didn't, it worked, but then. So for us it didn't, but the thing is, you do this, you're supposed to come here, copy this clip, and select with control these ones, 
and right click and paste them in attributes. But what happened between 10 and 11 was that in 10 it did add the fade out like the um, the animation in 11 it doesn't do that anymore so basically the brightness just stays at the same rate which is why it doesn't work anymore on 11 which is why I'm bringing this tutorial you don't even display it here this is I think easier what you're gonna do is you're gonna come to media generators make it a white put it right here and oops, don't close that. You want to open this up, and you're gonna to want to animate it. But you want to make the duration like zero, zero point. This is a really fast beat. I'm gonna point point three. And as you'll see, not crop. Um, go back here, and the opacity, like. The, po the opacity should be at whatever you want it to start out with the flash and you want to drag this all the way to the end and drag it all the way down so now you'll see this right here it just goes down and if you go like this you'll see it flashes can't show you with the real time but And you, uh, depending on the uh, rate of the beat, you're not going to want to go that fast, or yeah, that fast. But this is just a fast drum roll, so I'll just do it pretty fast. And just cut your audio. Just end it right here to make this a little bit faster for a render. And render this out. Desktop, I'll just do test. And render, and I'll come back when this is done. All right, this is done. My render time is like horrible for some reason. This is like ten times faster than ten, so I'm really glad I got eleven. I mean, I have a couple things open, but not much. Um, anyway, here we'll watch this. See how it looks. See, it's, it's pretty fast at that speed, but it looks pretty good. It looks basically the same as Genesis's, uh, not Genesis, wow, um, <laughs> as Hype's, yeah, throw like 97, okay, uh, it's Hype's tutorial, but this is like, like 10 times easier in my opinion, because all you have to do is select where you want the beat to start and where you want it to end if it's the same rate. Um, if it's a different rate, then you can just. I would just suggest hype tutorial because I don't. This is just for the same rate. Um, just where you want it to start, put a marker where you want it to end. Just drag the entire thing here. Just drag it from the beginning to the end, and all you have to do is change the duration up here. So you see a little tick mark here. That's where each different one starts. And yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, thanks guys. Um, leave a comment like what other tutorials you might want to see, or like what else I should do. I have no idea what to do next. Um, just leave suggestions or whatever. All right, thanks guys.